Okay, so for part two, as it were, we'll look at scoping an amp with the same piece of kit. Um, main thing to note this time is that when we use a probe on an amplifier of, of significant power, I'm not sure the camera will be able to focus on it. No. Um, there's a little switch here. And at one end it says times one, and at one end it says times ten. Make sure it's at the times ten end for an amplifier. And a fair old whack of power, and that drops it down a notch or two. For the O-scope sake, nothing else doesn't do anything to the power from the amplifier. So we just go ahead and hook up those clips to the output of the amp. There we go. Now, if you haven't touched it from your head unit, and this is a 1500 watt SPL Dynamics ICE 1500, if you haven't touched anything, you might get something like this. Just showing us a nice clean wave. Uh, the head unit is set to exactly the same as it was prior to, or after scoping, sorry. So we've got a nice clean wave, and the head unit's at its full clean unclipped signal. So all we need to do now is turn up the gain on the amp until we see clipping. And that would be clipping. <laughs> so wind it back a bit. And the test tone runs out as usual. Clean, clean, clipping to so knock it back one, or perhaps even two. And again, for the controls, shouldn't need to touch anything but these four. If you want to zoom in a bit, press the plus button. If you want to stretch the wave out a bit to check it's nice and clean, press to the right, so to the right opens it up, to the left closes it up, minus shrinks the wave a bit, plus increases it. So it really is just these four. And that's it. Head unit, 1500 watt amp, scoped, job done.